if I can tell one thing to American people, it's chill. Just, it's okay. The kids are going to smoke, kids are going to drink, they're going to try some drugs, but in the end they're going to be fine, it's still a great country. On April 22nd, 2013, New York City Council Speaker Christine Quinn announced a bill that would raise the age to legally buy cigarettes from 18 to 21. Reason TV visited NYU to ask young adult smokers what they think of the bill. I think that it makes about as much sense as the drinking age being 21, so. Do you think the, the drinking age of 21 makes sense? No, I don't. <laughs> Why is that? Um, because I don't believe that you should be able to fight in the army and not be able to drink. I don't like the idea of controlling what people can do harmful or otherwise to their bodies. Talk to us about smoking, talk to us about fatty foods and sugary drinks instead of just saying no you can't have it because when you say that it just makes you want to go out and try it, like be a rebel. It might attract more attention to cigarettes add more of a cool factor to it. And kids are attracted to illegal things. They like to do stupid things. And kids always find a way to get what they need. When did you start smoking? Um, like 16. So when the smoking age was 18, it didn't stop you from smoking? No. I started smoking when I was in high school. I started when I was 18, when I was a freshman here at NYU. When I was in middle school. Not very good, but yeah. 11th grade. Is there a, a, an age to buy cigarettes in France? There is, but no one cares. I know in Asian countries, or even in Europe, if you like drink and smoke at an earlier age, once you hit the legal age, people don't go crazy. But in, in the U.S., like once you hit 21, people are going crazy, partying all night, and they, I don't know, they mess their lives up. Age-based prohibition has proven to be an ineffective deterrent to alcohol and tobacco use. But if Christine Quinn succeeds Mike Bloomberg as nanny-in-chief, all New Yorkers can expect to keep being treated like children.